The AJF Board welcomes grant applications from individuals and organisations with an interest in actively supporting the bilateral relationship. When we review grant applications, we look for the right fit, where the aims of the project align with the objectives of the AJF. We continue to operate in an unpredictable environment, and so our board welcomes projects that can be adapted to comply with the changing COVID-19 related restrictions. That means that projects that include travel or large public events would need to have a plan for alternative modes of delivery. Your application needs to identify how the project would establish or build on existing links between Australia and Japan. Or alternatively, your project might address a gap or a new area of interest and cooperation between Australia and Japan. The AJF Board considers the capability and the capacity of you as an applicant and your project partner. That means that you need to have a project partner identified and you need to show that you have been in communication with that project partner. We'll look at your past achievements and your track record of successful partnerships. Finally, the board looks at the public diplomacy potential of a project. In other words, projects that engage Australian and Japanese audiences in such a way that strengthens Australia's influence and reputation. As you think about that, you also need to think about the sustainability of your project. AJF funding is for deepening an existing relationship or supporting a new initiative. But beyond the life of your project, you need to think about how you will sustain that engagement. It's unusual for the AJF to fund projects on a continuing basis. So if you're thinking of applying for an AJF grant, read the grant guidelines to understand your eligibility and the application requirements. For more information, follow the AJF on Facebook and Instagram and visit us on our website.